Dear church, as we approach this election season, let's take a moment to reflect on what it means for us as Christians and as Lutherans to engage in the voting process. We find ourselves in a contentious time with deep divisions in our society. However, even in the face of such disagreement, we are called to remember something deeper. We are all united in Christ. We are not defined by our political affiliations, but by our shared baptism and our commitment to the gospel. As people of faith, we are called to engage in our communities and work for justice and to advocate for the dignity and well being of all people. One way we do this is by voting, ensuring that our voices are heard as we shape our society together. Election Day gives us the opportunity to live out that commitment by speaking up for those who cannot speak for themselves, by advocating for people who are poor, hungry, and vulnerable. As people of God, we are called to love our neighbor as ourselves, and that love includes our responsibility as citizens. Voting is not just a civic duty, it is a way to serve our neighbors. When we vote, we have the chance to advocate for policies that reflect God's justice and compassion. When we vote, we should think more about the policies that affect the most vulnerable people in our communities, those that Jesus calls upon us to serve. This can be hard work, especially when the rhetoric around us is so divisive. But we follow a Lord who calls us to a higher standard. Jesus teaches us about loving kindness, mercy, and justice. And we are invited to carry those teachings into the voting booth. So as we prepare to vote, I ask you to approach this election with prayerful hearts. Let us think about not only what benefits ourselves, but also how we can best serve others. Let us ask how our votes can build a society that reflects what God desires, where every person is valued and where peace and justice prevail. Remember, we are not alone in this work. We walk together guided by Christ, trusting in his grace and always striving to do what is right and good for our neighbors. Together, we can create a society that reflects God's justice and love. Let's ensure our voices are heard. Let's vote.